Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will show you top best tips to improve hip fire and aim accuracy in Call of Duty Mobile. So let's get started. Airdrop incoming. Number one is camera sensitivity. Camera sensitivity is the most important setting for aim and hip fire because it helps you focus on target and look around comfortably. So first let's make the camera sensitivity value high and see what happens. On high camera sensitivity, you will not be able to focus on target because your camera will move too fast. So for the best camera sensitivity value, always set the value between 60 to 70 for better movement in game. Number to firing sensitivity. After adjusting settings and camera sensitivity, the next step is to make proper firing sensitivity settings because this setting is related to your crosshair fist while firing at target. First, let's make the firing sensitivity to high and see what happens. On high value your focus on target will become difficult and your crosshair will move fast when you try to focus on target. Causing your bullets spread in different directions. When you touch the fire button. So for the best firing sensitivity. Always set the value between 60 to 70 for both one tap aim and hip fire. Number 3 Aim Assist In COD Mobile, there is an option called Aim Assist so turn it on. When Aim Assist is turned on your aim, will automatically shift towards the target when they are within range of your crosshair. It will basically help you out by automatically correcting your aim. This is helpful for players who are still learning the game or who have difficulty aiming. Number 4 is crosshair to head level. During gameplay, never have your crosshair pointing downward. Instead, Always position your crosshair upward to head level. This will help to improve your headshots and aim accuracy in both hip fire and one top aim. Number 5 Get a Custom Crosshair Another way to improve your aim is using a custom crosshair. Go to Apple Store or Play Store and download a crosshair. Then practice until you've perfected your aim. Number 6 is Movement and Fire Button this is the most important setting, always set joystick to small. Let me explain, first set the joystick scale to maximum. If you use a big joystick size, it takes longer to move from left to right and sprint. Now let's make the joystick size small. With a small joystick you can do faster movements in any direction. Also make sure fixed joystick is off. When fixed joystick is off you can get the joystick anywhere you touch which makes gameplay much easier. Now let's talk about the fire button. Always set the size to big. 
because if the fire button is big, then it's easier to tap on screen and you will not miss any shots. Number 7 Best Aim Setting I've already made a detailed video on this. So I recommend you to watch that video to completely understand which one is best. Yeah, so check out the link in description. Number 8 Hipfire Mods Choosing the best mods for your aim. Especially for hipfire is the best option to improve aim. So in practice mode choose different mods to understand how they affect your aiming game. Number 9 Best Acceleration Setting If you choose the best acceleration settings, your aim during close fights will also improve. I will recommend you to choose Speed Acceleration and set the value between 100 to 200. Number 10 Best Gun Selection Another way to improve your aim is to use the right gunsmith. Ideally a good gunsmith is one with the most accuracy and control. So choose the attachments wisely. Hopefully those best tips will improve your aiming game. If you have any questions, feel free to comment them down below. And I will meet you there. Thanks for watching. Airdrop has been delivered. Flight will arrive in one minute. 